Good morning, everybody. We're out here at the Heritage Farm Live at the Stone County Fairgrounds in Wiggins, Mississippi. Uh, we're going to go down in here and check it out and see what we have going on down here. They say they have lots of different things going on. It has to do with farming, the old-timey fashion way of life and stuff like, like log that. Pools. Log pools. That's with what mules I'm interested in. Syrup making, different things like that. Mm -hmm. So, um, we're going to check it out. We're going to check it out. It's a nice, cool morning down here. So we're going to see what they got going on. They're a little late opening up. I see that already. Uh, they said at nine, it's already after that. So we're going to um, figure it out. We're going to figure it out, I suppose. Holy and chips. Well, she does. <coughs> I love these things. Do you? Yeah. That's the reason I bought it. Just to play. I set it up. Well, I had a heart surgery last year. Didn't get set in one. That's my second shit. You can't beat these things, I'm telling you. I got this one hooked up on. Me and Houston Jones hooked it up on electronic ignition. Really? What draft carburetor?
What kind of wool is that? This is um, a Jacob's four horn. It's actually the same sheet that's over here, the one with the four horns. Mm -hmm. This is, it's her fleece. Um, and this is also her fleece right here. And it's very soft, that one's very soft because she washed the fleece on the sheet before we were, she was shorn. And um, it's just a really good, it's just a really nice texture fleece. She looks different because she has those four horns but it's very nice very nice texture to it and i was telling her um this little girl that when i when we shear them after we shear them we'll wash the fleece because it's dirty you know you have a little bit of dirt maybe grass in there because they've been out in the field and then i'll put it on this carter right here this card machine mm -hmm. and it's like brushing your hair it just kind of fluffs up the fiber kind of gets it all going the same direction not totally but it mostly puts air in there and gets it ready for this step, which is which is the spinning. And I told, I was telling. Huh? Havana, that's a nice name. I was telling Havana that when uh, this is called a bat, this is the the fashion that it is in when uh, it comes off of the the drum carter. And when I go to spin, what you have to do is you have to just thin it out and when we thin it out like this it's called drafting and the drafting allows you to control how thick you want to put into your yarn uh, do you want it thin do you want thick chunky or cool. m maybe a medium and what is your um this is a spin illusion they're a company off of the west coast um washington state i believe We just took it out of a beehive. There's bees in the, the bottom. There's frames, other frames like this in there. And then we've pulled this frame up. And the queen is on here. She's not marked, so I found her a while ago, but earlier, but she's hiding again. But the other bees can come up and down, but the queen is on that frame. So I know what it takes to find